Hello, hello, hello everyone. What is going on? My name is Rob Crook, and I'm the founder of the Digital Nomads Forum. So, I'm gonna be breaking down the six biggest roadblocks that beginner digital nomads face when they want to do it. When they want to become a digital nomad. They want to make their journey. So this video is part one of a six video series. And we're gonna explore in this video, um, people who don't understand where to start. How do, how do you actually become a digital nomad? So one of the things that I hear all the time is that information overwhelm. People are experiencing it. They're uh, getting excited and interested in becoming a digital nomad, but where the hell do you start? There's a million people showing different ways how to do it. There's all these different Facebook groups, all these methods. You gotta figure out the remote work. How do you find Wi-Fi while you're traveling? What's a visa? What's a passport? Like, kinda know these things, but like, how does it work when you travel to other countries? Where do you stay? How do you find where to stay? How do you deal with international currency? Oh my God, so we just listed like six or seven different things together, but those are just a fraction of actually all the things you need to figure out, but don't run away yet because it's not as bad as, and it's not as scary as it seems. Because I wanna, I wanna categorize all of these things I just mentioned and more into kind of two big groups. Group one is the thing you actually have to figure out that's challenging. Group two, it's easy to figure out. So what goes in group one? Group one is one thing. It's actually figuring out how do you earn remotely? How do you earn money while you're traveling? And so in the video description, I'll include a link for you guys to a resource I've created that includes six remote work opportunities that work for anyone without experience and from anywhere in the world. So this resource is gonna be great for you if you're like not sure where to start. You're like, what could I even possibly offer? You can do these things without experience, so check that out. But the point of this first group, which is figuring out your remote work stuff, is that this is the biggest challenge. This is the most difficult thing you must go through to become a digital nomad, is figuring out the remote work, remote earning. If you can do this, all the other challenges, no problem. Those are all in group two, which is what I like to call the logistics, the Wi-Fi, the passports, the booking your flights and finding your accommodation and all those fun things. Those are easy. They might seem overwhelming because there's so many of them, but literally millions of people around the world have already gone through them. And so you've got groups like the one you're probably watching this video in, the Digital Nomads Forum. And you can post that specific question about Wi-Fi or passports and get very specific and correct answers on how to approach that thing in the best way. Now, you've probably maybe experienced it yourself trying to deal with the first challenge, the group one, which is how do I earn remote work? If you post in a group, how do I earn remote work? How do I become a digital nomad? You maybe have been frustrated with the answers you get because this is a big ass question. It is a challenging question to solve as well if you don't have the right people who've already done it to guide you along the process. So that's what I'm hoping to do in this video is kind of steer you guys into, don't worry about all these logistics. Worry about the remote work stuff. Check out the resource I'm gonna link for you in this video, it's totally free. And I think that's gonna be really helpful. Remember, you can take advantage of groups along the way for whatever challenge you're facing. And not just groups, but communities. So uh, a nice tip, one that I use myself all the time is for whatever challenge you're facing, whether it's you wanna become a digital nomad or otherwise, find great groups with interactive uh, people in them with you know people who have experience and you know discussions going on and ask specific questions don't ask vague general questions because then you're gonna get vague and general answers and make it really hard for people to really give you value and a good answer ask something specific so for example what are some of the examples of remote jobs that people are doing 
What kind of remote work jobs can I do without experience? So recapping this video, if you don't know where to start and the whole world of becoming a digital nomad seems overwhelming, yeah, it can be. But don't worry about all the logistics stuff when you're starting out. Simply focus on figuring out how to earn remote work and earn while you're on the go and all those other things are gonna be an absolute cinch to figure out in contrast. My name's Robert O'Crook. Uh, if you have any questions for me, leave it in the comments of this video. I'll personally reply. I really appreciate your time uh, for watching this video. Give me a like, comment, subscribe if it's on YouTube or whatever on Facebook. Thank you, bye.